Kelly McKenna, who's going off to Kansas and to run cross country and track, and Joel going off to uh, Missouri to run cross country. I want to congratulate the McKenna family and uh, just uh, appreciate your efforts and energies and wish you the best of luck next fall. Add that Aaron is heading off to lacrosse. Yeah. Repeat there as well. So congratulations to the whole McKenna family. So. Uh, Kelly, we want to have you come up here first and have your parents on either side and uh, you guys go about your business and just be casual about it and people will take pictures, etc. and anything you want, just let us know. Okay. okay. So I just sign right here. Where is it? I forgot. All right. Look at <laughs> There we go, Kansas Jayhawk, Kelly McKenna. Congratulations on your decision. Thank you. And uh, you're, you and your brother are all over the 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 what do they call it, the Corn Belt or whatever. Yeah. I mean, what is it uh, like to to be able to announce this on the same day as your brother and, and get this decision behind you? Oh, it's so nice. It's a really good feeling. Me and Joe decided when I decided Kansas that we would sign together. So just waiting for him to decide. So it took him a while. You you were yeah. you, you had figured it out long before him. What was the, what were all the factors that went into you deciding to go run at Kansas? Well when I went on my visit the team just felt like home and I really like the campus and the coach seems wonderful so I'm happy with my decision. What other schools were you considering? What other schools had offered either opportunities or otherwise for you to compete there? Um, well, I also looked at Minnesota Duluth. I was considering there, and I talked to the coach of Purdue in Indiana. And uh, where do you see, you know, your your future collegiately? What sort of events and and uh, and what sort of opportunities does Kansas present to you as an athlete? Well, I hope to still continue to compete in the 800 and move to the 1500 as well in cross country. Sure. And uh, as far as I know, the season's already underway mm -hmm. and uh, one meet under the belt. I mean, yeah. are you happy it's here? Is it oh, yeah. fired up? I mean, yeah. what's it been like uh, first you know, couple weeks of practice and the meet on Friday for you? Um, the first few weeks of practice have been hard. A lot of speed workouts, a lot of long runs, but I'm excited for the season. I have a good feeling about it. Why don't you review for us what you were able to accomplish last year in track and field and what you hope to accomplish this year. Last year I competed mostly in the 800 and the mile. did some open 400s, 4x4, and I competed at state in the 800 and 4x8. This year my plan, or my goal, is to make it to state in the 800 and maybe a relay with my team or the mile. But my main focus is to break the school record. Joe McKenna, going to Missouri, I guess, uh, how good does it feel to get the decision behind you and uh, be able to focus all on track and field now? Um, it feels good. I've been waiting all winter to make this decision, and I wanted to get it done before track, so it's nice to get it done early on in the season. What, uh, what went into the decision to go to Missouri? Who was, uh, what other schools were in the race, and, uh, and how did that all work out in terms of how they won out? Um, Madison was the main other school to run with my brother, but Missouri has a really good recruiting class coming in. It's a really good opportunity. They have a new coach, and so I just saw it as a good opportunity and a lot of potential for the future. And a lot of kids, you know, some would like the opportunity to run with their sibling, others not. Were you more in the camp of not? Did that matter too much? Um, I really wanted to run with him again. It was uh, hard to turn that down. It was a disappointing finish at the state meet, so it kind of motivated me throughout the off season. So um, I hope to get. I'm aiming for the school records, which are pretty pretty high goals. So, but that's my main focus. How many of those are held by your brother? Uh, he has a two mile one. He probably could have gotten the mile one, but he decided to celebrate instead. So. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> yes. And uh, one last question. This uh, great weather we've had to start the season, is it, does that accelerate where you're at already this year, or how does that work for Wisconsin track athletes? Um, it doesn't really make a difference for me. I'll be working hard whether it's snowing out, raining out, or sunny out. So it doesn't make a difference for me.